buy some death sticks? You don't want to sell me death sticks. I don't want to sell you death sticks. You want to go home and rethink your life. I want to go home and rethink my life. That car character, commonly known as the Death Sticks guy, has become an iconic part of the Star Wars fandom, but who is the actor behind the character? Meet Matt Doran. Um, so, on Star Wars, what was it like working with you and McGregor? Uh, pretty bloody cool. Yeah. Like, I like you and McGregor as an actor, and uh, unfortunately I didn't get to spend a whole heap of time with him, because my, my stuff that I shot was really super quick. Uh, but from the time that I was there, you know, uh, I... I quickly learned that he was, like I said, a super cool guy and um, just seemed like a, a dude that I'd be like, you know what, I want to have a beer with that guy. I want to have a beer with that guy, but he's got some great stories and he seems like a proper lad. And yeah. I like it. You know, so yeah, super cool guy. So next one, how often do you get asked for death sticks? <laughs> Today alone, it's got to be at least 15 times. Yeah. <laughs> and I must admit in conventions like these, you know, it's, it's, it's on the rise. You yeah. Know, but, um, yeah, you could say it's uh, the business is still going well. It's yeah. going well. Yeah. Excellent. So you didn't follow Obi Wan's advice then. I never take anyone's <laughs> advice. No, no, bad advice. Bad advice. Um, so being an actor, like you, we see really good sides of being an actor, and you're being on movies and hearing stories with different people. But what's a hard thing about being an actor? Like what, what? Not working. Yeah. <laughs> being, uh, you got to get used to the word no. <laughs> yeah, that's that's honestly that, that that to me is probably the most difficult thing about being an actor. It's great when you're working; it's a lot of fun. But there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of time, especially during COVID, when you're um you know when you're not working. So it can be tough. But you know I've been doing it for you know, God, oh, yeah, it's got to be like thirty years now or something like that. Now, <laughs> you know, so I'm de I'm I'm definitely used to the word no, and I've got I've got tough skin. So you know you just got to keep keep going keep moving forward and you never know when the next job is going to pop up or where it's going to take you which is one of the great things about the uh the whole the whole business yeah never know next you know, one day you might be in a bar standing next to you mcgregor trying to sell him death sticks you never know <laughs> <laughs> all right so we've got a couple of quick fire questions for you so star wars you said you're a fan so anakin or kenobi uh kenobi all right <laughs> um star wars or matrix I know, tough. <laughs> I'm going Star Wars. Ooh, okay. So, Kenobi or Neo from The Matrix? Just because of my childhood, I've got to say Kenobi. Oh, okay. Uh, DC or Marvel? Neither. Ooh, okay. <laughs> um, and red or blue pill, which would you take? All right. Well, thank you so much. We really appreciate the. Time. Hang on. The red, red's the. Red's the. You know, the, because I didn't. Ha I didn't have to wear the pill on the on the. <laughs> in the world. Red's like to go like to know the truth. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. 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 No, I just I wanted to definitely make sure of that you know yeah. what I mean. Because yeah. everyone's like, did your character what? actually? He wants to stay in the matrix and not no no. I want to know. I want to know what's going on. I couldn't remember if your character. Did your character take the pills, or was he born in Zion? No, I was born in Zion. Okay. Yeah. 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 Oh, hang on. no. See, now I'm confused, man. It's yeah. like no. You're gonna have to make me go back and watch the movies. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I mean, my character was like the youngest out of all the yeah. out of all the crew, but I was definitely I, well, I was no I was plugged into the machine though. You know because yeah, I, you, you know were. because so, I had a socket yeah, in the back so of my you neck. And originally, like, we were doing stuff where it was, like, plugs on the arm and everything, and which took hours to do the makeup, but we never actually saw it. So after a while, it was like, yeah, don't worry about that. So, yeah, I was definitely, I was capable of being hooked up, man. I was, so, yeah. so therefore, I wasn't. So you would have taken the pill at one stage? I must have. Yeah. 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 There yeah. you go. Right decision. Yeah. Good decision. <laughs> hey, hey, we... Red pill. We need like a spin-off of you actually <laughs> taking the pill. The amount of things I've done where there should be a spin-off. Um, <clears throat> Star Wars character, Alan Spies Bagano, you know, Disney. I think, you know, at least, oh, but that's ep it's, it's got to be at least an episode worthy of like, you know, the new Obi-Wan show, right? Do you know what? Yeah. I was watching that last night and we were thinking... We were what happened to Alan Spies <laughs> Bagano? Yeah. Did you go home and rethink his life? Someone actually on YouTube had come up with this. I've seen it recently. Yeah, I've seen come that. Up this whole backstory of what happened to my character after he left... Um, yeah. The cantina, you know, and I was like, 
this is amazing, man. This is amazing. <laughs> like, all the thought that's gone into this. Look, someone make a show about that, please. <laughs> is it weird that fans know more about your character than you actually know about your character? I wouldn't say it's weird. I think I think it's great that yes. uh, people are in, are invested in it that much where they've taken the, the time and, the, and gone to the trouble of coming up with all this all this info you yeah. know? and that's the great thing about the star wars universe you know is that you know you can there's just so much room to make up all these stories about all these characters and give them all this backstory and i think, I think disney know that that's why they're just making all these shows you know yeah. what i mean it's like someone could be an extra in a film and next thing you know they've got their own bloody show <laughs> so we're looking out for you next year you're going to have a disney plus show <laughs> called death <Destics. laughs> that's it what a show man at least the talk show like something like that yeah. you know i could have other star wars guests hey welcome to death sticks here hey, have one. <laughs> <laughs> Like it's a great idea. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much. We really appreciate thank it. Thank you very much. Hope you had a great day. Yeah, thank you. Thank, thank you. you.